Hello everyone, so I saw this article at Engadget. I'm not quite sure if I can show you the site because I, I have been uploading some videos lately and I'm not allowed to have ads on those videos. I'm not quite sure why, if it's the ads on the websites or yeah, if it's another reason, I'm not quite sure. But uh, I will read the um, specs from my cell phone and I will show you this picture. It's quite the same as how it seems to be looking. Uh, so it's about the Sony Xperia Mint. I actually like the name Mint. I know that there is a Linux version uh, that is called Linux Mint. So, in my opinion, Sony have made some a lot of Xperia phones that are pretty crappy, like the Xperia X10 Mini, and you know all those small smartphones. You know, they they are pretty slow, according to me. I don't know. Of course, they are low end devices, but still, and. This is going to be a high-end device. I'm not quite sure when it's going to be released. Uh, it will be released pretty soon, I think. Uh, but uh, let's go over to the specs. So it's going to contain a 4.3 inch screen. It's going to be a HD screen. It's going to be 1280 times 720. So it's going to be a 720p display. And the main thing about this device is that it's going to be a camera device. It's going to be 13 megapixel camera. I know the... I think it was Sony Ericsson Satyo or something like that. There was this... Um, I'm not quite sure what the operating system it was running. I think it was a Symbian. Yeah, whatever. Um, so that was a 12 megapixel uh, cell phone. I think that uh, pictures was really, really stunning in that cell phone. So imagine a 13 megapixel camera. You can zoom in a lot, and uh, yeah, you mean I mean you can take really great pictures. So let's go to the processor. It's going to be a 1.5 gigahertz S processor so this will be a astonishing fast smartphone I mean you may have seen uh, the HTC one s uh, it's it it's containing a s4 processor uh, running 1.5 gigahertz it's really really fast um, according to me and I'm not quite sure if this uh, experiment will have dual core or if it will have quad core. Um, yeah, it will be a 1.5 gigahertz dual core Snapdragon S4 with one gigabyte of RAM and 16 gigabytes of storage. Um, it's pretty nice specs. But I, I don't quite know if it will have a chance against the Samsung Galaxy S3. Um, yeah. That's the thing we will see when it get when it will be released. Yeah. So don't get your don't get your hopes up too much uh, about this device. The the specs is pretty okay uh, it's going to be a dual core I know that the s4 processor is really really fast but if it would be a quad core it would be unbeatable that's for sure but it's going to be a dual core uh, so let's see how this will turn out I'll probably make a video when it's released so yeah that's all bye